doing a quick little video in my screen room. Just a tip for anybody that's looking to do uh, some easy squeezy storage. Uh, this is going to be for uh, you guys that are working with manuals. So as you can see, here's my uh, old manual squeegees. Don't really use them much. Uh, they're up on a shelf. Uh, not taking them down. <laughs> you guys can get an idea. Uh, it's basically a two by four with uh, some 16 penny nails in there. Oh, there they are behind me. So the, the spacing in between the nails is an inch and a half. Uh, uh, they're across from each other on there. Um, so basically you just take a piece of two by four, mark off inch and a half lines, use a, a square and bang some nails in. Um, a little bit of a pro tip, if you take the nails, say you, you do them on a cement floor, turn the nails over so the head is against the floor and the point's pacing up, facing up, and just tap the point of the nail a little bit to, to uh, dull it, flatten it. What this does is well, when you drive it into the wood, because you're gonna to wanna to keep these nails close to the edge of the two by four, it'll crush the wood fiber and it'll just push the wood fiber right down. Um, if you leave just a point on it, when you put those nails in, I mean, you're not putting them in very far, but if you leave the point, it'll, it'll wet, make a wedge and it'll push, push the wood open and it'll be more apt to split it. Um, so that was it. I just wanted to give a little tip. I saw this sitting up here and I said, I don't know if anybody would be interested in it. Um, I used to have it just like this and it sat right on top of my dryer where squeegees were right there and nice and easy to get to. If this helps out, you're welcome. You guys have a good day. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to my channel, blah, blah, you know all this stuff. <laughs> Thanks. You guys have a good one.